Hey everybody, this is the supplemental material portion of the Moodle content. This is the spot where we talk about all the material that will be done in class. This first week, what we're going to discuss is the difference between playing a chord and playing a pitch. When asked to play a pitch, we simply pick one string on the uke and pluck that one string. That would be playing a pitch. When asked to play a chord, we need to strum at least three of the strings on the ukulele at the same time. A pitch is simply one note. A chord is made of three pitches. The first sheet in your supplemental material this week shows us how to find two pitches. The first pitch is C, which is actually just the open string C. And the second pitch is D. If we are asked to play C, we simply pluck that one string. If we are asked to play the pitch D, we pluck the same string. We pluck the C string, but we place our finger on the second fret of that string before we pluck it. This raises the pitch up to a D. The open C chord is indicated with the circle above the second string in the diagram. The D pitch is indicated with the circle with the number 2 on that same second string in the lower diagram. The number 2 refers to the finger that should depress that string. Not your first finger, but your second finger. Once you can successfully pluck both of those pitches, Lines 18, 19, and 20 on the bottom of the sheet are used for practice to toggle back and forth between them. Practice these lines until you can play them perfectly. When asked to play a C major chord, we place one finger on one of the strings, similar to the way we did when playing the pitch D. However, instead of just plucking that one string, we strum all four strings. This is the difference between a pitch and a chord. Here is the diagram for the C major chord. You can see that we still just use one finger, but of course, as we've said earlier, you must strum all four strings. We'll take a look at this in more depth in class. Good luck, everyone.